Hi, this is guide on how to get OpenWRT running on a Xiaomi WR30U router. I wanted a few cheap gigabit routers that could run OpenWRT from my home network. And I was looking to get the Xiaomi AX3000T. But recent reports say the V2 version of that uh, comes with advised hardware that can't be flashed. Not wanting to take a chance on the hardware, I found that the Xiaomi WR30U has the same hardware as the original AX3000T, but it can also be flashed with OpenWRT and is available relatively cheaply, but a bit harder to find online. Um, there weren't any on AliExpress, but there were lots of stores selling them on Taobao. I got mine for around 20 years tolls each, and then using your freight forwarding service to buy and ship them to me. With all the fees and shipping costs, the final price was around 90 US dollars for three units and took around three weeks to. You need Python installed on your computer. And then we need to do the initial setup for the router and can be done via Wi-Fi without connecting the router to the internet. Plug the power into the router, connect to it via Wi-Fi and access the portal at 192.168.31.1. The setup's all in Chinese, but you can just quick along and select the options that I do. Entering a password here. We'll meet this later when we run the patcher. We can disconnect from the Wi-Fi and reconnect using the password we just picked. And we can download the patcher from this GitHub and extract the zip to a folder. We'll also need the OpenWRT firmware files to flash. Search for WR30U on the firmware selector page and select the stock layout version. The U-boot layout, I'm not sure how to do. I might need a few extra steps. I will wait and color that here. We'll admit the factory.ubi file to flash initially, and then also this is upgrade file to install to OpenWRT after the initial flash is done. Bepanut PowerShell. Change to the folder that we've extracted, the patcher zip file to and run run.bat. You see this patch on menu. You can start with selecting option two to exploit the router to allow us to flash the firmware. Entering the password we selected earlier on the router setup. Then the patcher tool will take a few minutes to finish the exploit.
once the SSH server is activated. We can select option 3 to read the full device info and then after that. Option 4 to create a full backup of the original firmware files. These files are all saved in the Petra folder under the, the backup subfolder. Take the factory UBR open WRT firmware files and live them into the patcher folder under the firmware subfolder. In the patcher tool, select option seven, and this will flash the open WRT firmware. After it's finished flashing, Use an Ethernet cable to connect your PC to one of the LAN ports on the router. And then you can access the OpenWRT Lucy portal at 192.168.1.1. Here you can click Goethe Firmware Upgrade, then Flash Image, and select the Sys Upgrade image that we downloaded earlier to complete the setup of OpenWRT.